Hey Muffin, what are you doing on that sail? That's not yours. Okay, you'll need to get some tools together. Got a seam ripper, a pair of scissors, some sticky Dacron, some uh, Dacron thread. This is a big roll, you can do it with a little spool if you want. Sailmaker's palm, come in handy. Not, might not need it, but if you have it, it's great. And some sail needles. Now, if you break a laser upper mast, it's going to rip the luff sleeve. Um, now, a sailmaker might do it differently than I do, but this is a, a DIY instruction. Now, use the seam ripper to take out the stitches between the luff sleeve and the, uh, the luff of the sail. Um, there's, uh, it's glued down a bit. Um, you can uh, pull that apart and open it up enough so that you can comfortably get your hand in. Now you've got to patch the inside as well as the outside of the luff sleeve, otherwise it'll catch on the mast when you try to rig the boat. Um, I've always done the inside first, though I suppose maybe you could do the outside, but uh, this is the way I've always done it. Uh, fold it in half and we're going to sneak it inside and, uh, and stick it down. Now I peel the backing paper off of one half so we can work on one side at a time. and just trim off the excess flush with the uh, edge of the luff sleeve. Flip it over, peel off the other half of the backing paper, and stick it down. Now we'll put sticky Dacron on the outside. Now be sure to align the uh, outside reinforcement with the inside one uh, because we're going to stitch it around and uh, this way one row of stitches uh, around each side will, uh, will capture everything. Everything's white on white here, so I know it's a little bit hard to see.
Now, fortunately, sail needles have big eyes, because with a regular sailing needle at my age, usually when I go to thread it, the eye blinks. Uh, you want to use a regular sail needle for this because they have reinforced backs. You use a regular small sewing needle. Not only hard to get the, um, the thread through the eye, but they tend to snap off and it will stick you right in the hand. Now we're going to use a baseball stitch to uh, trap the edges of the, um, of the reinforcements. Uh, in, uh, on the inside and the outside of the luff sleeve. Uh, be careful not to sew the luff sleeve closed. And here we've done one edge of the uh, sticky Dacron reinforcement. I'm going to use a little beeswax on the thread here, just to help it slide through a little easier. Once the top and the bottom of the uh, repair is uh, stitched around, uh, we're going to sew the left sleeve back to the body of the sail. Uh, I try to go through the old original holes whenever I can. Uh, this will help preserve the strength of the sail. And that's what it should look like when it's all done.